right, I'm remaking this tutorial because the first one I did was not as accurate as it should have been, and I'm working on my cover of this song, so now I know how to play this song a lot more accurately. And uh, so the tuning is in drop to B flat. And uh, to start off, the intro sounds like this. Okay, and all that is, uh, you're gonna start by going open, two, two. And then you're gonna go two, three, two. Okay, so that goes. Then you're gonna hit the second fret two more times. Okay, and then on the sixth string, you're gonna go open, two. Just hammer on there. And on the fifth string, you're gonna hit that third fret. So that goes. Okay, so that together slowly goes. Okay, and then you're gonna do the first part again. And this time you're gonna go open five. So the second half goes. Okay, then all you're gonna do is go up to the 10th fret barred and strum that. And then go down to seven. And then right here you're gonna go open, two, three, two. Okay, and that's right where the verse comes in. Okay, and the verse is also uh, really simple. It's just a couple of chords, and it's, it goes like this. Okay, and all that is, I have an effect on here called tremolo. It's actually called opto tremolo, but that just makes it make that sound that goes in and out the... Okay, all you're gonna do, the first chord is uh, third fret, fifth string, next two strings on the fifth fret. Okay, and then right after this, you're gonna hit open. And then right after you strum open, you're gonna strum the last two strings, the first and the second string. So it goes. And then the second half starts with the uh, second fret barred. Okay, and then after that, you just move back to the power chord, back to open, and these two strings. Okay, and then the uh, next part is really, it's the my favorite part to play in the whole song. Uh, it goes like this. Okay, and that's going to repeat twice. Uh, the first off, you start with the second fret barred, and you're going to palm mute and strum that three times. Okay, and then right here, you're gonna go. And right there, all you're doing on the sixth string, you're gonna open five, seven. On the fifth string, hit the fifth fret. Back on the sixth string, you're gonna go seven, five, and end on seven. So that slowly goes. Okay, and then you're gonna do a second fret bar again. And this time you're gonna go. And all that is, it's open 5-7 on the 6th string again. And then 5th fret of the 5th string, and you're going to slightly bend it as you play it. Okay, and then uh, the next chord that you're going to uh, strum is the same as here. You can start there. But on the 5th string, you're going to go on the 3rd fret. So it gives that, that weird sound. And on this one, you're going to go. And all that is, it's open 2 open and then five, four, and then open two. That's probably the easiest one to play because it's all just right there. And then the last one you uh, strum open, palm muted. And this one goes, it's open, five, open, and then four, five, four. Okay, and I'll play the whole thing slowly so you can see what I'm doing. Okay, and then after this, <coughs> the pre-chorus goes like this. Okay, it's really simple. It's just a couple chords right before the chorus comes in. And it's that power chord that I showed you earlier, third and fifth fret. And it's gonna go to open, back to the power chord, back to open. And then right before the chorus hits, you're gonna strum that open one more time and then mute the strings. So the last part goes. 
like that. And if you listen to the song, you can understand the timing there. Okay, and then the chorus is really simple. Uh, the rhythm guitar plays this. And then it repeats right there. Uh, second fret barred, and then right here on the uh, third string, you're going to be on the fourth fret, second string, fifth fret. That might be some uh, kind of a stretch to people with small hands. So if you can't do that, um, what you can do is just strum the two, and then strum uh, first and second string open. But you're actually supposed to play it like this. Okay, and then after that, it's open. And then tenth fret. But on the second and third string, you're going to be on the 12th fret. And you're going to strum those strings on the fourth strum. And then right before you repeat, you hit open once and then down to two. So. I'm going to repeat right there. Okay, and then... Uh, Everything after this chorus and before the next chorus is already, I've already showed you how to play. But the second chorus is slightly different. Uh, the rhythm guitar is the same, but the lead guitar comes in and plays the... Okay, and that's just going to repeat... Um, that, uh, that little tapping part right here actually doesn't come till later, so forget that. Um, but start with your finger on the 10th fret on the first string, and you're going to be going to the 12th fret, 14th fret, and the 15th fret. So make sure those are accessible with how you're holding the fretboard here with your fingers. Okay, it's going to go 12-10, tw 12, 10, 12 and then 15, 14, 10. So... Okay, and then the second part is very similar, it goes. So right there you're just going 12, 10, 12, and then 14, 15. Okay, and then let's play it again. And right here, how it ends, instead of going 14, 15, you're going to go 15, 14. Okay, and I'll just teach this next part now so I don't forget when I get to that part uh, in a few minutes. Um, you start right after you finish that, so it goes. You end right here with an open. Next measure, you go on three. Okay, and this part goes. Each fret that you're going to be hitting here, um, you're going to be picking the string four times, and you're only going to fret on the first pick, so it's going to go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Like that. And it's going to go five, seven, eight, seven, five, three, five, two. So five, seven, eight, seven, five, three, five, two. Okay? Okay, and that's where that riff repeats. Okay, and then this part comes in, it sounds kind of like. And all that is, it's 5th and 4th string. Starting on the 5th string, you're going to go 7, 10, 7. 4th string, you're going to go 12, 7. And then right after you hit 7, you're going to play a harmonic on that fret. So. And then on the 5th string, you just go 7, 10, 7 again. Okay, and then when the solo starts playing, the rhythm guitar plays this. And that's just going to repeat. Um, you start off, it introduces by going open, three, open, palm muted. Okay, and then right here, um, the thing that repeats, it goes two, five, two, and then eight, seven, three. And then there's a thing right after that. But those are the main chords that repeat. So it goes two, five, two, and then eight, seven, three. And then you do two, five, two again. Okay, and then um, in Breaking Benjamin, what they do is they actually play octave chords and they slide them around like I showed you in the other video. But I found for when I'm recording my cover, this actually sounds uh, better for what I'm doing because it's kind of hard to figure out what those octave chords are. But all you do is go open two five. So. And then it repeats right there. Okay, and then the solo comes in and it sounds like this.
Okay, and then right here is where it gets really fast. Um, what you do is just slide up to the 12th fret, and then 15, 14, and then 15, 19. 15, 14, 17, 15, 14. Back down to 12, and then 15, 14. And then right here is where it gets fast. Um, sorry, I had to change the lighting. My uh, my lamp cover was catching on fire there. So uh, anyways, but yeah, those are the notes for that first part of that solo. And if uh, you want, just go ahead and pause the video, look at the tabs until you get it, or just come back, practice it later, whatever. Those are the notes. And then the fast part, I'll play slow, it goes like this. Okay, um, what you're doing is you're going 14, 10, 12th fret on the second string, back to the first string, 10th fret, 14, 10, 14, 15, and then right here you're going to go 14, 10, three times. And on the second string you're going to go 12 to 15, and you're going to land right on the 12th fret of the first string. Okay, and obviously that's played really slow. <clears throat> and uh, if you want to practice that, what I found helps me is uh, finding a metronome online and starting it really slow, playing the solo to that speed, and then slowly speeding it up, and you'll eventually get there. Okay, and then the second half goes. So that part's a little bit different than before. It uh, starts on the 12th fret. 15, 14. Then 15. 19, 15. 14, and then right here you're going to go 20, 15, 14. So. And right here you're going to go to the second string, 12th fret. And on the first string you're going to go 12, 14. Okay, and the next fast part goes 8, 10 on the second string. And then 8, 7 on the first string. I'm basically going to show you these in four notes at a time, but that is that goes. I know the tabs show to uh, play that on the second string, 13 to 12, but um, I like to play it this way. It's just easier for me. You can do it whatever way is uh, best for you. Okay, those are the first four notes. Okay, the next four notes on the second string, you're going to go 10, 8, 10, and land on the third string, ninth fret. And right after that, on the third string, you're going to go 12, Second string, 10. Okay, and the next four notes on the third string are 12, 11, 12, 11. So you can just pull off on those. Okay, and then the last four notes, uh, fourth string, 12th fret. And then third string, you're going to go 9, 11, 9. Okay, and then the last note that you hear that really high pitch is a harmonic on the third string, 9th fret. Okay, and that's the uh, end of the solo and how the rhythm guitar ends that it goes second fret three times and then open fret three times. Okay, and then right here goes right back into the chorus and that brings us to the end of the song, which sounds like this. Okay, it starts by going two, three, two, and then open two, and then you're gonna hit the third fret of the fourth string and then right after you hit that, you're going to go two open two. So I'll play that slowly. You're going to do that again. Except you stop right before you hit that note. So the first part. Okay, and then right here is where you do the walk down. It's going to go eight, seven, open, five, seven, open, three, five, two. And you end right on two. So. Okay, and that's how that song ends. That is I Will Not Bow by Breaking Benjamin, a lot more accurate version. Um, so yeah, the cover should be done within the next week and a half or so, and I'll upload that. So thanks for watching.